going to be making a donut with sprinkles because what's a donut without sprinkles? So the first one, we have to add a, let's find it, a torus for the donut. And you can add any color you want. I'm going to add pink because some donuts have pink frosting and it tastes good. So we're going to move it over a little bit so we can press the arrow. And then for the sides, we are, for the radius, we're going to put 7. For the sides, we are going to put 20. For the steps, we're going to put 25. Oh my gosh. And for the, up for the steps, we're going to put 15. So now we need to get a block, a box, and add that right under there. You can pick any color you want. This is going to be for the sprinkles. And then we are going to press the arrow again and make sure that the width is 2, the length is 6, and the, the height is 10. The edge steps you can keep and the uh, the edge you can keep in the edge steps. So now we're gonna go to modify and add move so that it will move to the side of the donut and rotate after this loads. Okay, now we we'll have to go to rotate and add that. For the X, you're gonna put eight, and then for, for you rotate, you're going to do axis Z, and you can do any degrees. I'm going to do 45. So now let's see what this looks like. There we go. So that's our first part of our sprinkle. So now we're going to have to add another box for the donut and I'm gonna do a light pastel color let's do let's do light purple and then for the width length and height we're gonna do the same thing as the other one so that it's the same shape and it doesn't look off so now we can keep that like that let's move this over a little bit and we're going to add the move and rotate again so that it is moved instead of in the middle of the donut. And for this one, we're going to put in the middle for Y, 8. And now we have to get rotate. And then we're going to have to do axis C. And then you can do any degrees that you want. Try not to do the same, because then it would be in the same direction, and it would look weird. So I'm going to do 15, and we're going to see what this looks like. Okay, so that's what it looks like so far. And now we are going to get another box for the donut, for the sprinkles again. And make sure we move it under the rotate and then get whatever color you want oh my gosh whatever color we want then let's make it blue color then do the same thing for the weight for the width length and height so that we can have the same sizes After that, we're going to add the move and rotate. Move. Rotate. Oh, my. Okay. And now we are going to put in the Z column. No, wait. Yeah, no. In the X, we're going to put... We are, oh, that's the wrong one. We're going to put right here, negative 8. And then you're going to put axis Z again, and then any degree you want. 
I'm going to do negative 30. Now let's see what this would look like. Oh my, that looks so good. And now we're going to add another box. This will be the last one. We're going to make sure that it's under the rotate. We're going to pick any color you want. Let's pick let's pick red and then do the same thing for the width length and height so this yes okay after that you're gonna add another rotate and move so that it can move around so now and now we have to add the rotate and for this one you're gonna put in the y negative eight and axis y, y and then any degree that you want now let's see how our donut will form oops I forgot we can't do a big number so let's do 15 Okay, let's see how this turns out. Perfect. And that is how you make a...